Happy Chicken Day, everybody. Oh. Or whatever this is. Aw, now Chicky can finally live up to his ancestors and look just adorable while doing it. <laughs> what a cute little nugget. In fact, it looks like all the animals are having a costume party today. Oh. A dog dryer. Let's hope today's toys are all about our furry friends. But first, let's make sure it actually works. Thank goodness we already have a wet puppy. What a good girl, staying calm while putting something on her. Let's hope she stays nice when the dryer turns on. Well, if you ever wanted a puppy puppy, here you go. Wow, it works. And while you're here, why don't you subscribe? Anything that makes balloon dogs is worth its weight in gold. A dog umbrella? Wait, how is she going to be able to hold that handle? Something tells me that chain is going to answer that. Right, the hook keeps the umbrella close by while you hold it. Good thing, too. It looks like a real storm out there. And there's even room for two. But the important thing is that the dog's okay. I guess this is a tool that you and your furry friend can share. Yeah, relax those smile muscles. Seriously, she smiles way too much. But let's try it out on your cat. Wow, he seems to like it. You've got yourself a real Cheshire cat here, don't you? I wonder if it works on pets other than cats. <laughs> let's see. This thing seems to be a real crowd pleaser, doesn't it? From this angle, this thing almost looks like a face. With this pouch, now you can always keep your best buddy close by. After all, why should kangaroos have all the fun? They've had it good for too long. Make sure to zip everything up. How on earth did she get that jacket on underneath? Aww, now you can take your dog on bike rides through the park? Keep him close while doing your laundry and other chores. And even introduce them to various babies. I mean, you probably can do that without a pouch, but where's the fun in that? That lady's just jealous that you have a cuter baby. What makes this cat toy more interactive than regular cat toys? Well, I guess we're gonna find out, aren't we? Oh, wow! Huh, it moves on its own. All the fun of playing with your cat without actually playing with your cat. Hmm. Or the fun. Yeah, in other words, some cats just have good taste. I wonder if we're gonna see anything for that baby chick. A duck muzzle? For your dog? I guess that's close enough. Okay, I see. This way, your pupper doesn't sneak snacks without you knowing. Especially any suspicious breadcrumbs. Yeah, that's right, I read Hansel and Gretel. And your puppy's already got a Halloween costume, too. Of course, dog care is a little more than just fun and games. Being a responsible pet owner can be real dirty work. In other words, honey, that's not a purse. Well, get your bag ready. It's time for a walk. Oh, man. I don't want to know what you've been feeding this dog. Good idea. Use the tool. You don't know where this toy's been. And you can throw it away without getting your hands dirty. Hey, don't tell me what I can and can't use for a purse. Well, whatever this is, I'm having flashbacks to my pet hedgehog. Which is weird, considering I've never had a pet hedgehog. Aside from Sonic, that is. Either way, it's a paw cleaner, and it looks like you need to put it together. Complete with some water and a lid. Make it tight. And it looks like we already have some dirty paws to try it on. She's caught red-handed. Or maybe uh, brownish-gray-handed. Three, two, one. Success! Her paw is nice and clean. But don't forget, she's got four paws. Make sure to really get in there. And we've also got a nifty tool for cleaning those paw prints on the floor. A mop. 
This thing looks like a gadget from an old-timey sci-fi movie. Please tell me you're not feeding candies to your dog. Okay, good idea. Try it for yourself before testing it on your dog. I mean, I wouldn't want something happening to the dog. Good thing your dog's such a good girl. It's always time for a treat. Wow, that's a good catch. Did she do it a second time? Yes! Third time's a charm. Make that fourth. Good girl. No one cares about the fifth. That'd just be excessive. Yeah, a dog deserves a nice treat after a good workout. What's this? Oh, it's a brush for doggy bath time. Only now, we just need a magic tool to get your dog in the tub. Oh, that's clever. You even get to sneak in the soap. And every second counts once your puppy hits the water. Wow, either you have the most well-behaved dog on earth, or your pet fish is in serious need of a haircut. But seriously, how do you do it? Extra walk, double kibble? Don't forget the towel. We don't want her to shake herself dry. Although I'm surprised such a good girl doesn't towel herself off. If only everybody else was so easy to train. By the way, who gets to tell them that's the dogs? Hmm. What's next? A tennis ball? <laughs> Come on, that's an old classic. Now that's more like it. Adding a techno twist. Oh, uh, not that kind of techno. Either way, she seems to be having a good time. If only they made something that puts the balls in for you. Cool. With this next tool, we get to play doggy dentist. By the way, have you subscribed already? Come on, even your dog wants you to do that. Hey, bad girl, that's the dogs. I really need to keep an eye on her. That's better. And by the looks of things, or rather, the smell. We picked the right time to try it out. If only she'd open her mouth. Don't forget to hold her still. I should have spoke sooner. There's a reason they invented dental chews. Those toys were doggone awesome. Catch you next time. Looks like we've just stumbled upon the mysterious city of boxes. Hey, sup, kitty? How's it purring? Yeah, these cats sure know how to party. Resting up for a big day of sleeping. Geez, I wonder how they got those posters in there. Oh, look. There's a pair of little dog boots and balloons? Good, they look like a perfect fit. Perfect for a winter workout. Keeps those little paws mess free and looks cute while doing it. Let's try the other one. Cut off the rim of a balloon and add it on. And look. After a walk, the balloon shoes are just as durable. Wow, a donut and a ladle. I wonder what they do. No, wait, that's not a real... Yeah. Well, if you can't eat it, wear it. And it protects your pup from getting lost. Now, how about the other one? A nice big ladle can work just as well. And the best part is, your dog can also help you serve soup. Ah, huh, looks like more things for your pet to wear. But this time, we're going with cats. Make sure Mr. Kitty is nice and secure. Zip up that zipper. Wow. Now 
your cat can get lost in a good book as you hold it for them. Hmm. Okay, our plan B is going to be wearing this shirt like a pouch. In you go. Now he's got a nice place to relax as you prepare him snacks. Two different brushes for your cat. Because cats deserve nice things. It even catches and releases all that excess fur. <laughs> now it's a wig. Oh, we're gonna add some special touches to this brush. Cool. It's like you made a little homespun scratching post. Oh, you gotta love that the cat does its own brushing. But all that hair? A licking mat? Oh, and it looks like hanging it up is a breeze. Wow, this should also make bath time a lot easier than usual. Maybe the plastic wrap will work too. Even if it goes on your head? Well, this should keep those aliens from reading your thoughts. Oh, good boy. Doggo stays still during a bath and a manicure. That's a whole spa day. A collar that lights up. Now that is a real fashion statement. This'll really step up your dog's laser tag game. And of course, making him easy to spot in the dark. Then again, we can always make this out of glow sticks. Just keep adding them on. And make sure that they fit, and hopefully last a while. And just like that, your pooch is ready for a rave. Our pets have spent a full day of pampering, so let's keep pampering them! It's like your cat has a bunch of tiny hands with tiny fingers all at his disposal. Toothbrushes will save on batteries, but the important thing is that the cat's happy. Good idea. But a cat can't spend all day being spoiled. It needs some playtime. What cute little mice. And cool, they come in a lot of colors. It makes you wish that real mice were this fun to play with. But as we all know, a cat's favorite toy is the box it came in. Especially when you get to play with it together. Aww. Oh, good. Now our canine friends get to join in on the fun. And with tasty treats. Come on, puppy, put your nose to work and find those goodies. Seems like fun, but can we repeat this game with a towel? Just lay the kibble on the towel and then roll it up, like sushi. Seems to work just as well, but you're not sticking the toy in the laundry.
Of course, after a treat, your dog needs something to wash it down with. Normally, you shouldn't put water in flowers. It's not nice. But this seems a lot nicer. We made ourselves a fountain. Cool. And would you look at that. He likes it. But can a water bottle be more than enough? Let's try it out. Well, as long as it's secured to the wall. Either way, your puppy gets a nice drink. Yeah, petrific stuff. And thanks to our furry friends who helped out with this video. Catch you next time. Instant cats. Just add water. <laughs> and they say cats don't like water. <laughs> Let's just sneak on by. Aww. Nothing to see. Home free. Oh, coochie coo. <laughs> this is gonna be a great day. Oh, I jinxed it. Hmm. This bed could use a makeover anyway. <laughs> Remove this wood. Add a panel to the side. Oh, anyone getting dizzy? A fresh coat of paint fixes up everything. All three walls. Let's see what we can do for the outside. A stencil pattern. Let's spread on some paint. Who says we need a brush? Besides, this is much faster. Peel off. On second thought, a brush can take care of the little details. Look, a cat face. As if you didn't guess who this was for. Hmm, this hole looks scratchy. And not the kind cats like. This cat door will help make an easy entrance. And with the help of these toothbrushes, the cats will get the scratches they like. Let's take a quick tour, shall we? This grass carpet will please the wild cat inside your pet. What else can we add? Hmm, an old pizza box? Cover with tape, and you can make a few steps. Steps right to the cat's own private bathroom. Meet the new and improved litter box. Now, what else do cats like? How about this? Take some rope and twist it around a base. Tie it so it's nice and tight. And your cat has a new scratching post. What else? Maybe they'll like that pigeon. Oh, even better. Take a desk drawer, add pillows, cushions and some toys, and it's a brand new bed. Here's something we can add to the wall. Now your cats have their own private television. Oh, it's getting hot in here. You know, the cats might want a drink. So, let's give them their own fountain. After all, it's easy to get hot when you can't take off your fur coat. Always smart to try things out before trying on the cats. Now that they have water, they might want something to nibble on, too. And we're going all natural with cat grass. And there's plenty of room for a bowl full of cat chow. But let's keep the fridge stocked with wet food, just in case. 
Everything's really coming together. Let's add some more toys. Well, he's off to Wonderland. What's down there anyway? Ooh, candy. Oh, this bowl should fill up the hole. It's the perfect place for some cat toys. And if the cats are feeling a bit hungry at playtime, this toy's the perfect thing. Just add food. See? They'll get a treat when they spin it around. That'll keep them active. <laughs> hey, can we borrow this pillow? Now take some tights and cut them up. We need an X shape with some material in the middle. Tie each of the two opposite ends together. It's like a bed and swing all in one. Let's test it out. You know, these buttons can help get their point across. They can tell us when they want water, food, or even playtime. It's a bit too small to be a staircase. But we can still use the base. Attached to the wall, and we've got stairs after all. Hey, you're not using this giant bucket, are you? <gasps> Thanks! Huh? Now that we've cleaned it out, we'll cut out an opening. Huh, what else do we need? How about more toys? You can never have enough cat toys. And we can use them for a project. Hot glue them to the patch from earlier. You remember from the hole? Add them to the bottom of our can for a soft cushion. Now break out the power tools. We're drilling some holes. After making a few, run some thread through them. It's kind of like a checkerboard pattern. The cats are gonna be so happy. Where are they anyway? I uh, think you've got a little something there. Oh, that gives me an idea. Add hot glue, press it down, and it's as good as laminated. Perfect for keychains or personalized collars. This cat toy's interactive. Let's add it to our collection. Cats sure have good taste. This looks fun. Cat food? Maybe we should leave some things to the cats. Oh, it's just a toy. And we've got the perfect place for it. You know, it's a little small. We need to think bigger. Let's get a large glass container filled with water. Fill with stones and marbles. Add a plant. And the finishing touch, these cute little fish. I spy with my little eye, well, her eye, eyes, a plastic bottle. Empty it and cut it up. Take the bottom and hot glue some string in the middle. Now use the string to reattach the two pieces. Add a pom-pom to the top and fill with cat chow. Hang it up. More snacks? These are gonna be some lucky cats. Cool, a laser for our cats to catch. Let's try it out. Either it's the laser or she needs to clean her pores. Hard to catch, just what we need. What's on your head? It's like a fidget spinner. Let's add to the wall. What can't be improved with the addition of stickers? These pictures will help give it a more homey feel. 
some more toys. Cats sure know how to live. Maybe we can put this tablecloth to better use as the curtains for our brand new cat hangout. Yeah, this is where all the cool cats come to play. Great place for a nap. You gotta for a big day of sleeping. Still, look at all the fun stuff to do. Eat grass. Use stuffed animals as a floor. Or just relax. Looks like someone's ready to play too. Or maybe just stretch. You gotta love all the accommodations. And there's still so much more to explore. Who needs steps when you have a giant scratching post to climb? Unwind, watch a little TV, have a drink. Oh no, he's found the cats. I mean, what cats? Oh, it's love at first sight. Meow, horrific stuff. Catch you next time. Oh, trash day again? Yeah. Seems like we did this last week. Uh oh, the raccoons are back. Oh, wait, that's no raccoon. Oh, what a cute little puppy. And look, no collar. Good thing you already got this pet backpack on you. Aquariums, they're not just for fish anymore. Huh. There's not a lot of leg room, is there? With a backpack like that, he's ready to go into space. Right out of the case, and he's already got muddy paws. Oh, right, you found him in the trash. Well, a nice warm bath should perk things up. Or don't dogs lick themselves clean? No, wait, that's cats. How cute, a dog brush. And it even has a little place to hold your soap. Rub-a-dub-dub. This must be a dog's favorite type of bath. The kind that doesn't use any water. But it works. Mm hmm Good thing. Otherwise, he'd be shaking the water off. And we wouldn't get this tender moment. Wow. He must be clean to be on the furniture clean. And now he gets his own wardrobe, too. Huh, a little big, but maybe he'll grow into it. Oh, wow, wow look at those nails. Ugh. We need a manicure hmm. stat. Sure, I've seen green nails before, but that was just paint. Why stop at the nails? Let's take care of that fur, too. Mm-hmm. Of course, the most important part of a beauty routine, canine or otherwise, is keeping clean. Cue the foam. Still, no true day of pampering is ever complete without some form of facial mask. Ooh. Hmm, what else can we do for our day of indulgence? Oh, good idea, some brushing. With a tongue? I repeat, isn't licking yourself clean more of a cat thing, not a dog thing, or a people thing? At least it seems easy to clean. Ah, uh, now for a massage. Oh, and look, we've got a gadget for that too. First a nice neck rub, and then just work your way down the back. Hmm, does it work on people? Well, I guess you can after all. Though you should probably ask before using it. Hmm. Time for dinner. Good, because I haven't eaten in like a whole hour. Mmm, a nice salad. And the puppy gets... Mm, just some kibble. And even he doesn't look too appetized. Maybe it's all in the presentation. Let's cut along the lines. It's just like coloring. 
and we want some bend to it, so add some tape. Now everything's got a nice shape, but still, we don't want to show off something that looks like cardboard. Gold-colored paint covers hmm. all sins. Ooh. And so do a bunch of fake jewels. Just don't advertise the fake bit. Man, and all this just to host the dog food bowl. Speaking of which, can we jazz up the food here too? Great! Good boy. Look at him eating. All gone. Guess it's true what they say. You reap what you sow. Wow. I wonder if that dog knows the goose that laid the golden egg. Anyone think they're related? Well, into the drawer. Oh, what's this? Oh, this hmm. looks like a collar. Huh? Just what our four-legged friend needs. But it needs something extra. Rhinestones are nice and all, but we want something personalized. And a photo will help show ownership. Well, oh, looks like he's on a roll. Literally. He's gonna look so handsome with his new collar. Which means that it's the perfect time for a selfie. Give us a smile. Show us some teeth, but not in a show of dominance sort of way. Any other photo ideas? Let's make a fun border. Now pick a theme. Ah yes, the source of all happiness, money. Just don't use the real kind. Though by the looks of things, this new owner can probably afford to. Oh, he'll look so handsome in his portrait. Surrounded by Ooh. money. Just like Scrooge McDuck. Oh. After all this hmm. pampering, it's finally time for our puppy to relax. You better be planning a game of fetch taking hmm. his ball like that. Oh, wow, hmm. a golden bone. Let's hope it's not real. I mean, you could chip a tooth. Hmm. Seems like enough fun for today. Oh. It's time to get ready for bed. Oh. Or instead, time for another craft. Hmm, with this mold, we can make a bunch of little jewels of different sizes and colors. Put them all together, and we can make a fun mobile. Like for a baby crib. Just hang it up, and he's fast asleep. Wow, I thought he would need a bedtime story or two. Let's cut back to daytime. Time for a fun dress up. Ooh. And don't worry, just because dogs don't normally wear clothes doesn't mean they can't accessorize. <laughs> mm. Ah, adorable. Huh, he doesn't really seem to be a hat dog. Got anything else he'd like? How about hoodies? Well, the light up buttons have spoken. No, oh, but red is certainly his color. And it looks like he agrees. Just add some chains and some sunglasses, and he'll make Snoop Dogg look like Snoop Cat. Ooh. Let's see what other outfits he'd like to try. A white tuxedo? Does he look like James Bond? Hmm, maybe another color will do. Oh, he seems to prefer the more <laughs> classic black look. And it certainly seems to suit him. Oh, he's just so cute. What big eyes he's got. Time for another day of fun with your furry <laughs> friend. <laughs> what can be better than a puppy? Simple, more than hmm. one puppy. Ooh. And this one's so big, you just want to cuddle him up. And soon, there'll be even more puppies. In the meantime, our blushing bride wants some kibble. And maybe a steak or two. That was bow wow-tastic. Yeah, I went there. Catch you next time. Oh, hi, N. Find any buried treasure? Let's get sifting. Ah, it's A. 
Now that's what I call treasure. <laughs> but let's clean up all that sand. Maybe pluck some of those grubs. Now all he needs is a good scrubbing. Much better! Now you're ready for some beach time fun. Hmm, what could be better than sand ducks? When they've got even tinier ducks inside. Look, he's the right size for this slide. Quick, go again before it gets crowded. Told ya. Something this fun doesn't stay empty for long. Here, some letters will help us tell these ducks apart. Poor doll, did your friends forget to dig you out? And did they take your legs too? Don't worry, one lower half coming up. Just need some glass beads and glue. We're gonna need some hair for this. Look, he's a centaur! After all, four legs are better than none. Ooh, chocolate spread. What could be better? Oh, cookies! And candy coating! And sprinkles! And maybe another cookie! Oh, I get it! It's a baby fish! Isn't he sweet? Watch your step! Eh, anyone want ketchup? Oh, look at your foot! It's a mess! Good thing we got our handy dandy foot bath. Ooh, soda and mints! Things are about to get bubbly. And don't forget, you have another foot. Almost done. Now that's one clean foot. Hey, watch your step! Ooh, what's that? A chip box? We can use it to make a new sand castle. Just sands sand. But it can have candy. It helps that they're already brick shaped. What a pretty tower. And the best part, this top even comes with chips. Have you ever seen a beach tower? Oh, look! It's a tiny little octopus! Let's blow it up into a big, bad kraken! Wait until you see it in the water! Oh, I guess he's swimming away. It's okay, we've got a backup balloon! Why don't we fill it up with treasures? Wow, look at all that shiny stuff! Once it's all in, add some water. That should be enough. Tie it shut. And give your new stress ball a good squeeze. Hey, what's that? It's a water marker! What you waiting for? Let's try it out! Wow, look at all those different colors! For a real show, put it in some water. Don't worry, the color's still good. Dunk your hand in, the water's fine. Aw, oh, what a cute little wiener pup. And they blow up so fast, don't they?
Still, this popper could use some fur. Now she's a real dog. Thank you, Blue Fairy. And she's got a surprise. More puppies are on the way. Good thing she went to vet school. Cause it's time for a sonogram. Oh, look, someone's having triplets. Which means you're eating for four now. Well, that just proves my point. Good thing we've got our handy dandy pooper scooper. Just look at that face. He's so happy to help. Oh, me so full. But me could always eat one more. Puppy owners need to keep up their strength, too. And if she can get a treat, too, she won't complain. Though you're kind of getting a little messy. Don't worry. This hula hoop will help. Of course, a little water's just common sense. Let's dry you off. And just in time for a little <laughs> costume change. Sometimes you just need a random dance break. But we could do without all this hair. Some durian fruit should help. Slice in half and add some hot glue. And stick to the wall. Now it's a makeshift scratching post. One that will keep all that hair in one place. Of course, we want puppies to have a little fur. Oh no, and you didn't even overwater it. It's simple. Our pup needs a secret garden all her own. Ooh, let's add treats our dog will appreciate. Eh, maybe make sure they get in the hole. Come on, girl. It's time to look for buried treasure. And maybe you should try trimming them. Uh-oh. Someone got into some paint. Still, these are some nice paw prints. Cut them out and shrink them in the oven. Now that's what I call puppy size. And they're your collar's crowning glory. Ooh, are the sheep visiting? Wait, no, someone's teething. Don't worry, we'll give you something to chew on. Stuff up some tights. And we mean plural. Now staple them up together. Well, this should give us a hand. You know, there's always time for a manicure. Now, you've got the best seat in the house. Hot dog. That is one big sausage. You know, bread's not the only thing that can be a soup bowl. Besides, she likes her ramen to have extra meat. And there's plenty to go around. Okay, we really need to start cleaning under here more often. Or at least keep better track of our tennis balls. With a little needling, keep them on a string. <laughs> In fact, this works for all sorts of things. Hang them up. It's like a party in a cube. Of course, all good parties need snacks. Now for the big unveiling. It's like a puppy playroom. 
the piece de resistance, the tennis ball. Oh, she's gonna sleep good tonight. Silly puppy, that's for drinking. Uh, sort of. Good thing it comes in fun size. Press the button and fill her up. Have a drink. And when you're done, how about some TP? Ooh, a watermelon. Let's slice it up. Well, that's one way to do it. Still, we'll need a few more cuts. Now it's time to scoop out the good stuff. But first, we're gonna need the rind. With some eyes and ears, it's a puppy! Hmm. As for the red stuff, let's get out the cookie cutter and make some fun shapes. With all these animals, it's our very own zoo. Now, one for me, one for you. It's selfie time. Well, that's not going on the fridge. Don't worry, all you need is some handy dandy cardboard. Time to put those art classes to work. All that green can only mean one thing. It's a dinosaur! Well, almost. <laughs> we still need a head. And we've got just the right one. Perfect. You can be anything. The limit's your imagination. Sometimes puppies need help communicating. But all you need are just a few buttons. Now your dog can let you know what it needs. Whether it's playtime. Or just a drink. Or even a little pampering. After all, it's hard work being this cute all the time. Now it's time for a massage. Or as she calls it, a belly rub. Well, I guess your photo needs a new frame. Better yet, let's get a document folder. Now you can finally give your photos an outline. Like you're in your very own cartoon. Huh, that's an idea. We'll just need a projector. Tape it on. Add some light. and enjoy the show. This is just what the wall needs. Go grab some paint and put those tracing skills to work. <laughs> A pacifier? Oh, that gives me an idea. Hmm. It just needs another cut and we can add a Scooby snack inside. Let's add a decoration while we're at it. Aw, now she's giving us a smile. Is anyone else feeling dizzy? Oh, it's laundry day. Hmm, I guess those jeans were dry clean only. Well, at least we know someone they'll fit. Something tells me this happens a lot on laundry day. Well, now they're mm -hmm. two of a kind. Mm. You know, you should really take turns. Don't forget, she's got an audition for a kibble commercial in an hour. So, when can we expect the puppies? Bow wow-tastic stuff. Catch you next time.